um, located on campus at Barnes St. Peter's. Uh, this is St. Peter's Gynecology, and um, I'm through the BJC Medical Group. I'm solo practice in gynecology, uh, minimal invasive surgery, and hormone replacement therapy. Currently, I'm the chairman of the Department of OBGYN here at Barnes St. Peter's, um, and I've had that position now for eight years. In undergraduate school, I actually started college as a music major and um, ended up getting a degree in psychology, but my concentration was in stress management, and I, I found that those people that had managed their stress seemed to be healthier. And it just seemed like one thing fell into place, so rather than working on a PhD in psychology, I turned around and started looking at medicine. I chose this specialty when I was going through my training because I found it very interesting that in taking care of women, they seem to be much more attentive to their health care. Um, and it progressed into thinking I was going into family practice, wanting to do more gynecology, and I landed a residency in OBGYN. I think the most unique quality in my practice is one that what I can offer for minimal invasive surgery. Um, I wish more women knew that they could undergo a surgery as major as a hysterectomy on an outpatient basis and be back to work in a week instead of these prolonged, you know, four to six weeks recoveries from these major open procedures. And that's where I really pride myself on. The, the surgeries that I can do all through the belly button, you know, with minimal um, um, invasiveness. And then the other aspect of my practice I'm so proud of, out of all the OBGYNs of St. Charles County, I'm the only physician that, that I'm aware of that has an active practice in bioidentical hormone replacement therapy. And every day I, I get thrilled when I see these people that are truly appreciative of how well they can feel after being told this is as good as it gets. I think the biggest quality in choosing a physician is that the physician looks you in the eye and listens to you. We're all in a hurry. We have a limited amount of time. Uh, we have so many time slots to get so many patients in a day. And I just find so many patients that are so frustrated in their care because no one is listening to them. I discovered St. Peter's actually when I was in my residency. I moonlighted here, and I just this whole community, it's it, it's grown quite a lot in the last 20 years that I've been here. But there is a, a unique quality about St. Peter's, and I also have this incredible love for this hospital. I think this hospital is unique than any of the other five or six hospitals I've worked out of because every individual in this hospital owns it. You know, they take a part of this, and I think that as a community, we have something to offer to St. Charles County, which I think is unique than any other hospital in this county.